Well, presentation can be designed in many ways other than PowerPoint. Figma is one of them. The best part is that it allows customizations and overall presentation management in a much better way. The free form tool in PowerPoint has limited functionality. The pen tool of Figma is amazing. The overall ease of use and management of artboards and preview is just phenomenal. Stay with me. I am creating one free form art business slide for you. You will be amazed like how easy it is. Here is the interface, clean, minimal and easy to use. You will love designing on the Figma. Here are the tools for you to create something awesome. I am more interested in pen tool. So quickly insert a frame. What is frame? It is basically a canvas, our board or a background on which you will design your slide. You can select the frame size. Click on fill and apply solid color. Dark color is preferred. Filling colors is very easy. You also adjust the stroke and effects. But for now, we only need to change the color. This looks good for now. You may want to lock the layer so that you cannot select it while designing. Now comes the important part of this video. A free form magic. Select the pen tool and just draw a pattern. Just scribble roughly using the pen tool. It is very easy. Think of a pattern in your mind and try to draw as close to your concept as you can. Create beautiful patterns, textures, or abstract using the pen tool. You can create anchor points which can be manipulated to create different shapes. You can adjust the curvature of the lines between anchor points by dragging the direction handles that appear when you create the point. You can also use the pen tool to create curves by clicking and dragging to create a curve. With practice, you can use the pen tool to create intricate and complex abstract designs that can be used in your Figma projects. When using the pen tool to create abstract designs in Figma, it's important to pay attention to the positioning of your anchor points and direction handles. You can adjust the position of the anchor points by clicking and dragging them, and you can adjust the length and direction of the direction handles by dragging them as well. With some practice, you can create smooth and seamless curves and precise angles and shapes that fit your design vision. Additionally, you can use the pen tool in combination with other tools and features in Figma, such as layers and masks, to create more complex and dynamic abstract designs that can enhance the visual impact of your design projects. Here you can see, I am filling gradient color in the abstract design. I am using angular gradient type. There are many other gradient fill options as well, but angular gradient is what I need right now. Experiment with the different gradient types and colors to create an awesome output. Using pen tool you can create anything matching the content. It also saves time as you can create custom shapes very easily rather than adding and subtract shapes to design custom shapes. Now we have created the shape design. Let's do something about its placement. What should I do? Let's duplicate it first and then rotate it. Now you can see a beautiful pattern has emerged and this is what I wanted. So just scribble something with the pen tool, add gradient fill and you will get a beautiful abstract. Here I am doing some final adjustment in terms of placement. This should look good and then only you will subscribe to my channel. Well you can subscribe now. We have filled the right area. How about the left side? As you can see, I have duplicated the layer by pressing Ctrl D and placed it on the left side. This will balance the design. Using the pen tool you can create endless themes for your business presentations. Now it is the time to add some text on the slide. How about a title? Simply click on text box, start typing the text and from the right panel adjust the properties. It's super easy for you. What I like about Figma is its ease of use and I never get bored while using Figma. Here I have added a dummy text. Change its color, font, font size, placement, etc. As I always say, text styling is also important. Text styling in Figma is crucial for creating effective and readable designs. It allows you to control the appearance and hierarchy of text elements, ensuring that they are clear and legible. Text styling can also help to create a consistent visual language throughout your design, making it easier for users to navigate and understand your content. Don't settle for less. Here I am tweaking to make this main title more interesting by adding linear gradient with the direction from top to bottom. I have apply opacity effect on the bottom side of the gradient fill. This gives it a very interesting color style.
duplicate the text box and just change the text. Isn't it easy rather than inserting the text box again and they again applying the formatting? Think smart. Some final touch-ups and ensuring everything is in place. The design is done. Quick and easy. Let's preview it. My friends, here is the preview. This looks amazing. If you have realized this is just a free form art and nothing special we have created. Bring out your creativity and build something awesome. We will see you guys in our next video. Oh, I forgot something to tell you. Please subscribe.